most people mistake plasma cluster ion technology with any other ionizer this misunderstanding leads to fear about plasma cluster producing harmful ozone in the process of purification through this video we will get into the truth about safety limits of ozone and what are the symptoms in case the level increase we will also check the sharp plasma cluster device with an ozone checker to confirm whether plasma cluster produces ozone during the purification process kindly watch the video till the end and don't forget to subscribe our channel for regular updates let us first see how different levels of ozone can affect us as per who the safe limit of ozone in an indoor environment is up to 0.05 ppm if the level goes beyond 0.05 ppm is when the problem starts happening and in initially we will start detecting a nasty smell and some kind of people can also have nausea if the level goes up to 0.1 ppm there could possibly be irritation in nose and throat and if the level goes beyond 0.2 to up to 0.5 ppm there are possibility of eye irritation in a long exposure if the level ex exceeds beyond 1 and 2 ppm a person can get headache nausea on continued exposure let's have a look at the instrument and kit used to verify the ozone levels for sharp plasma cluster it has a acrylic box which consists of a ozone checker the ozone checker shows a numeric as well as color signs if the numeric display goes beyond 0.05 ppm which is the permissible limit for ozone it will show in red if it is within the permissible limits it will either show green or yellow and here are the outcomes of the test as you can see from the photographs which has been taken at various intervals no traces of ozone could be detected in the meter and the indication both the digital indication which is showing as 0.000 ppm even after 30 minutes of test and you can see the light indicator also showing as green confirming that the process of sharp plasma cluster purification doesn't emit any harmful ozone